Hi guys, welcome to my channel once again and this time I'm gonna be sharing how I do my eyebrows. So basically what I do with my eyebrows, I like to tint them or some people like to call it henna. So this year I went to the salon to get the keratin treatment on my hair and since I was already there, I, I thought why not do my eyebrows as well. So I had heard about henna eyebrows before and I had never tried it before since I was there. I thought okay, it would be the perfect time. So basically I got it done but I did not like the shape that the hairstylist did on my eyebrows. I did not like it at all and I actually have a blog post about my experience at the salon which I'm gonna leave the link in the description box in case you want to read about it and since then I did my research to be able to do my own eyebrows and basically I came across this little kit which I can't remember if I got it from eBay or Amazon but it brings everything everything that you're going to need the little color the developer everything is in here and this is the dark brown but I noticed that if I do black the results last longer when I use the dark brown it tends to last between two to four weeks but if I use the black one it tends to last four weeks I got this for around ten dollars and it brings three capsules and each capsule I'm able to use it two times and I remember at the salon I paid ten dollars for one henna eyebrow session so this saves me money time and I can do it in the comfort of my own home and like you said I just love the results because they always look filled in every morning when you wake up it saves you time and I just love it so so much so if you want to see what this little kit brings and how I tint my eyebrows just keep on watching so I'm gonna start by tweezing my eyebrows and this way I'm gonna have my eyebrows ready Once I'm done, I'm going to continue with the next step. It brings the wax strips. It brings the developer lotion. It brings the instructions, the color capsules, the mixing sticks, and a mixing cup. I've never used the waxing strips because I'm too scared. So with the little mixing cup. And it brings three capsules, but I always use half of each because I always see that is just the necessary amount and I'll mix the developer and I'm gonna put about the same amount of the mixing color and as you can see it has the same consistency as lotion and now the only thing I'm gonna do is mix it together until I see it's very well dissolved Okay, so I have it ready here, so I'm going to apply it now. And you can always apply some Vaseline around your eyes, and that way it will prevent any stains, but I never apply anything. And in case you are looking for a natural alternative of Vaseline, then I recommend going to Etsy and finding one that has very natural ingredients, and I found this one. It has very few ingredients like lavender oil, rosemary extract, coconut oil, even this little label is from recycled paper from a glue that is cruelty free and with no animal ingredients and this is how it looks like. So I'm going to be using this plastic stencil that already has an eyebrow shape and this way it's so much easier for me to fill in. So I'm going to place it here and little by little I'm going to start filling it in. very black and now uh, all I'm doing is just cleaning up around it and now it's ready so I just want a straight line here so I'm just gonna clean my other eyebrow before I apply the tint the henna and I'm gonna repeat the same steps and I'm just going to make sure it looks the same as the other side. And 
and I just hold it in place and I start filling in. You can use a makeup remover wipe or a baby wipe. I'm gonna be using a baby wipe and as you can see I'm removing all the color. result. I really like it. I really like how it looks and it really saves you time every morning and that way you don't have to be filling in your eyebrows every time you have to wake up and do your makeup and this way it's gonna last from two to four weeks. So I hope this video was somehow helpful and if you have any questions or suggestions for me you can leave it in the comment section and you can also find me on my social media accounts. I have Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest with the username Lynnsire. And if you have liked this video, you can give it a like and that lets me know that you have liked this video and that way I can continue making more videos. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Mwah. Bye!